The original video is linked in the description down below. Enjoy. All right then, so in this one, what you're gonna see is how to deal with a stop and account situation. This person did it absolutely perfectly. So we'll get straight into it and you can see how it's supposed to be done. And this is how you should be doing it. I like some ducks. Probably think I'm doing something illegal, which I'm not, but let's see what they, let's see what they do next. Excuse me? Yep, smash. Why is there any of your concern? Mm -hmm. Why is there any of your concern? I'm just wondering, could you show your thing park and then you're in here? Is there anyone you're waiting for? Or? Do I have to answer that? I'm pretty sure I don't. Well, no, just it, help me understand why you're here. So, just to jump in here, it so far is doing absolutely brilliant. Don't answer any of the questions. You don't have to help them understand anything. Just ignore them, let them know you're not interested in the conversation, and then carry on. I don't have to talk it's to raining. you. Well, I don't have to talk to you. If you're, say, if you're concerned about me walking because it's raining, I don't think that's, that's pretty interesting. Okay. Is there anything you're up to, though? I'm, I'm, again, I'm, I'm not trying to start an argument or anything like that. Again, it's none of your concern. I don't know you. Okay. But yeah, given because you want to make a thing about this, what's your... Yeah, what's your badge number? Uh, no, what is it? Two one seven one. Oh, what's yours? Two two four three. All right. I was. And what station are you? Uh, do you operate? Stokey, but we're not searching you, mate. All right, we're sure. just having a conversation. With you. So this officer saying we're not searching you, mate. We're just having a conversation. Don't make a difference. A member of public is asked for you to identify yourself. You should identify yourself. It is that simple. When asked to identify, you identify. The officers did this, and then. Trying to say we're not searching, we just want a conversation. He don't want a conversation with you, and he's showing you that he knows what he is talking about. So just leave him alone. You don't understand the issues. That's all. Huh? That's all. You're free to leave now. I can leave whenever I want. Uh, I'm sure. just having a discussion with you. You don't have to be acting up like this, do you? Okay. That's fine. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, you're, yeah, you're allowed to do that. People are making a big deal out of it because I'm walking in the rain. <laughs> Look at them still just literally waiting there. Like you saw, I'm I'm, I'm clearly waiting here because of the rain uh, under underneath the tree, and these people are just there staying because they think that they're trying to start something. They want to get some kind of confrontation or whatever. Ridiculous. I think now they're finally leaving. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> Look. Now they've stopped again, and now, they, uh, 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 now they've restarted on their journey. <laughs> Fucking clown. So as you've seen, these officers wanted no part of it once they realised this person, they couldn't bully this person to get his information and that lot. That's why he come with his little phone out straight away, because he thought he could bully him to get his information, and it didn't work. They ended up doing the walk of shame, and then they did the driver shame twice. But this is a perfect example on how to deal with police on a stop and account situation say nothing let them know you know what you're talking about always identify them and then just ask them to leave is as that simple but let us know in the comments down below what you thought of this interaction as always like the video it does open youtube's algorithm and i'll catch you on the next one